Okay guys, so welcome to what the fuck? Welcome to the room transformation video. So I'm gonna show you guys like how my room is right now. Girl, this is my helper for today. <laughs> Just sit in there. Anyways, here's an overview of my room. I'll give you guys a little room tour real quick. This yeah, is there. I that bed is there. It's actually really ugly. My room is really ugly. Um, but I ha I want to paint it. And right now we're just kind of cleaning it out. Like I'm kind of putting all of my makeup in there. Because I don't want this thing. I don't want this vanity anymore. It's just taking up space. And I honestly really do not want it anymore. And then. um, So yeah. So basically I'm just putting everything over here. And then I kind of stack things right there. Because I think I'm going to do this last. This part last. Because I have to take these out. And it was a hassle, so I might just paint over them. But it depends, because I think my boyfriend's going to come help me tomorrow. Um, but yeah, basically, I'm just cleaning it out. And I'll time-lapse that. And then I want to get rid of this, but knowing my Jima, she out here being like, don't move my stuff. Like, girl, first of all, I pay rent, and I don't even got enough space. As you guys can see. Look, that's all hers. And then from here to over there is all hers as well. Mm, great, huh? Anyways, I'm gonna clean it. I'm gonna clean that out, and I'm gonna show y'all in a bit. And then that's like for the new room that I'm planning. So I'll put that in the garage for right now. And then I bought this thing at Michael's because I want to put my hair stuff and everything here, and I want to get rid of that one. So yeah, I think it's dope. Um, so yeah, that's what we're doing right now. And then I also bought new bedding from Shein. Y'all see that? Y'all, you guys will see that later. But right now I'm just washing my clothes to get rid of that fucking space. And then yeah. Um, I'm gonna time lapse it, so yeah. Okay, so so far this is the progress. We're getting there, as you can see, I took out um some of the leaves of my room and then um basically i put everything in this little corner because this little corner i'm not gonna do i'm gonna try to just get the big corner done today or i feel like i'm gonna do this corner because like they're oh that's a mess ooh. anyways and then my pants and my shoes i need my shoes i'm gonna stack up in there but like i'm not sure like the garage is like full with my stuff from here as you guys can see um but yeah i just need to find a place for my shoes and then I'll be good, and then I'll be straight, and then I'll see what I can do. Um, yeah, and then I need to take that off. I need to also take my LED lights, even though I don't want to. Because I feel like I finally got them in the position that I wanted them to be in. But I don't know. I'm going to see. Because I know I can paint over them, because I don't really... Oh, well, no, I can't. Alright, I'm going to need to take them off. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. I'm a messy-ass painter. Anyways, I'm gonna show y'all what I got so far. Look at my fucking clothes, dude. Literally, who the fuck? Mm -mm. Okay, anyways, so basically I'm gonna paint that little red thing because I don't like the color and I don't, I don't like the contrast to it or whatever. But we got that, we got up there, and then when my boyfriend comes tomorrow, I'm gonna make him do the fucking roof because hell nah. And then we did that, and then we did that. See, this is, and then we still have all of that to do. Anyways, it's fine. I don't know who the fuck allowed me to paint, but dang, how the fuck is that possible? Okay guys, hello. So today is day two of painting and this is my room right now. Like it's it's almost right. I'm just painting this. I'm painting over those little um black thingies. Those black thingies hold those like triangle thingies. So anyway, the boyfriend's supposed to come today, but I don't really want to do the ceiling. Cause like who the fuck is gonna look at the ceiling? No one, no one. Um, I might paint the door though. I'm pretty sure I am because it's like a different type of white. So it's like a gray almost. You guys can like really tell the difference. It's not white white, which I like. Um, anyways, I'm I did like two coats or some shit like that. I don't know. I don't really want to keep going. I'm so tired. <laughs>
Oh, what? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go get some later. Okay, guys, so this is the desk. I spray painted it with some spray paint. As you guys can see, it's gonna be. That is my always talk. Okay guys, so my room is pretty much dried up. Um, I used the broom, nasty ass broom, to, um, you know, broom up. What is it? Broom? I don't know. But now I'm using this little thing to take off the paint from the ground because I'm a really messy painter. Like, y'all see that? Look, like, there's one. Okay, here's a quick overview of my finished room. It's painted. The only thing that's not painted is the ceiling. And I don't want to do that. Mm -mm. Anyways, here is the final little I painted the door. Oof, that looks fucked. Mm, it's not perfect at all. I did this so quickly and then I fixed the floor a little bit. I don't know, there's still like paint on the ground. But I don't want to do a deep clean. Anyways. Um Yeah, now I gotta see how I want my room to be rearranged. Okay guys, so I completely forgot to film. I'm super sorry. I hold up. Anyways, I'm super sorry. I forgot to film me decorating my whole room and kind of just setting it up how I wanted to. I'm really sorry. But yesterday, um, I kind of just set it up real quick. And my boyfriend kind of helped me um, figure out where to put what and what and what. So, yeah. And then um, we had one to work. Sorry. We had one to work because I needed some things. And I spent almost $200, and I realized I didn't even get a lot of things for my room. Like, nothing. Anyways, I'm going to show you guys what, um, how my room looks so far. So, this is a little overview of it. It looks really ugly right now because it's not, like, finished. Um, but basically, um, I need to wait um, to get some things, like a new, bed a new bedding because it's supposed to come on Friday or on Saturday. So, I'm waiting for that. That's the room. I'll give you guys in like an official room tour when it's when it's when it's done. But as of right now, it's not done. But yeah, just giving you guys a little update on my room. Um, the f why did I blow a kiss? I'm sorry. Anyways, yeah, I'll see you guys like next time, probably on Friday or Saturday or Sunday. I don't know. I don't think Friday. I don't think Saturday because I'm gonna be busy and I don't think that my stuff is gonna come in on Saturday. Anyways. Okay, guys, so welcome to my final room. It's not final, but I want to just give you guys an overview. Um, probably just, I probably won't add anything else to it, but this is the final room. Let's give y'all a room tour. This is me convincing my cousins to record me. Can you guys record me, please? Oh, Lord. He's going to record my videographer. Yeah. Wait, wait, did you put the flash on? Flash in there. Okay, okay, guys, welcome to my room. Come, come inside, buddy. This is the overview of it. What do we think? See it? Yeah, okay, okay. Now, first, I'm going to start, you guys, over here. Um, So, here we have my TV that is literally not in use at all. Um, Here we have this little thing. It says, Happy Birthday, Arim Paulette Cordoba. We love you. Uh, my dad made me this in 2008, as you can see. So I have it here, and my brother found it. We have these little plants. These little plants are from Daiso. And then we have books. All these books are from Target. I'm really into poetry, so I got these. And then here we have a little another freak plant. I think I got that at Ross. And then I have leaves all around. And then my dad made me this. It's like little cubes and stuff. He made that for me. And then here we have my vinyls. We have Playboy Cardi, Juice World. This was mostly for like um, aesthetic. And then this is like a thrifted book that I got. And then we have Cabin. And then on the bottom here, we have all like my electronics. This is what I use as my light. And then we have some fake Crocs. And then my Crocs that my boyfriend got me. And then on me, I have my gray Crocs. And then you. We're gonna close the door just to give me space. 
here I have my dirty laundry, so you don't really want to see that. So then we have this little Bowser thingy. Um, what is this called? A blue shell. A blue shell, sorry. I got this in a Mario Bros. like Mario Kart kit at Target. It was a waste of $60, but it's okay. Then we got this little vase. I got it at Daiso with these little fake flowers that I got at Daiso as well. Then we got my vinyl record player. Um, I usually just use this for Bluetooth and stuff like that. I got this as a Christmas present for me to me. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. And then here I have the little vinyl record player. Then here's a closet, you know. And here I have like my sweaters that I'll usually wear. Um, it's packed as you can see. And then here I have all my shirts. So I have my graphic tees. I have my tanks and like my short crop tops. This is kind of broken. Ugh. And then long sleeves and my work tees. So that's what this little closet is. And then we move on to the bed. My cables and then this is my bed. Um, so I have two mattresses stacked on each other because I don't know what to do with the other one and I bought it and it just wasn't the size for my twin bed. This is a twin bed. Um, this is my brother gave it to me and it's like a really good um, couch, not couch, foam. And then up there we have leaves. And then here I have this little planet light mm -hmm. that I have to replace with batteries. It's always on so I have to replace it with batteries because like if I turn off the light, it's not as bright as it used to be. So you just kind of see that there. It's kind of cool. I want to get one with my middle name. Um, like a customized one with my middle name. But here, these are my little throw pillows. This is from Urban. This is from Urban. They were each 30 fucking dollars. Because I'm, look, this is $30. I could have made this. For a pillow? Yeah. I got this at Target. This was also like around 30 bucks for no fucking reason. And then I got a new pillow. I guess this one like, I don't know. This one is like a good one. I don't know. I got this at Walmart for like $8. My bedding is from Shein, and I usually use this as a blanket. Now we're going to move on to the rug. This is the rug. I got it at Walmart for like 60 bucks, bruh. Oh my god, literally unbelievable. Okay, then my little chair. This chair is from Ross. I got it for 40 bucks. Ross, is, Ross and Walmart is like your little home decor place to go to. Then this is my desk. This is the desk that I had before. I just spray painted it white. As you can see, it's like really poorly spray painted. Literally really poorly spray painted as you can see, but it's okay, we made it work. And this little book thingy, like organizer thingy, I got it at Daiso for like two bucks. And then we have like my personal notebook, my YouTube notebook that I don't really use, extra notebooks and my planner. Um, because school is out already, I cleaned it out. My laptop, this little stand that I got at TJ Maxx for like six bucks. I used it to put my laptop there. And then here, this little thingy, I got it at Walmart. I got it at Daiso, and I just have kind of Sharpies, pens, tapes, pens, because I'm a pen lover. And this mug, my boyfriend gave to me, and I just put this little plant in here. And it's just like a cool little decor. My curtains are also from Walmart. They're $12. My rug is from Walmart, right there, this one. It was $9. And then in here, I have some paintbrushes. And then back there, just more like supplies and then my paints back there. And then down there, I have books that I don't really need and use. And then the back, it's more canvases and this like chalk bulletin board. And then we're going to move on to my favorite part of my room. This section, all of this is my favorite part of my room. Literally, it's super cute, super me. Here we have cardboard. The reason we have cardboard here is because... When you go outside, like through this way, because this is to go outside, as you can see, it leads to the outside, to like the garage, and usually where we have family gatherings and stuff like that. So, um, when you come in, so you don't like get my carpet dirty, you just kind of put your shoes here. And even when I go out from here, I like to kind of, um, clean my shoes here i don't like when people step in my room with shoes you can literally ask anybody i hate it but moving on to the posters this is from walmart.com i've had this for around two years already as you can see it's already messed up but this is like my prized possession this i plan on keeping until i have kids and i'll give it to my kids and then this i got it at walmart um this is the same plant that i had before i dust it off every once in a while i got this at ross for quite a few bucks actually 
Um, this is also from Ross. It's like a tree bark right here. I got this from Daiso, but it broke, so I need to go get a new mirror. And then in the back, I have a candle. And then this is a little, um, yeah, you see the candle. And this is a little basket. I have my, like, my work IDs here, but because I don't work there anymore, I kind of put them aside. Um, mm -hmm. But I'm going to work for the same company, guys. It's just different location, but I'm going to get a new badge over there. But anyway, so this is a little basket from um, Daiso. I got two masks. I had a bunch of masks, but I lost them. I have the little clicker for my little tripod and then just the key to the gate. And um, I'll put other little things in there. Um, then we'll move on to this section of my room. Here we have these paintings that I did. This is Betty Boop. And then this is a little cartoon devil Casper thingy majigger. And I thought that was really cool and cute. Um, I, have, I put my hats on this side and then my bags on this side. So I have this one from Shein and this one from Urban. I just need to kind of do something to it because it got really messy after I started, um, after I washed it. Then here we have, this is my little wallet with my house keys. And if my Jeep was fixed, my, my car keys would be there. I hope you hear that, Nino. Here are all my jeans that I usually, I'm trying to wear and my favorite jeans. Um, I kind of have, these jeans I wear a lot. These jeans are like new ones that I got. And then these are all like white jeans. There's like four to five pairs on each hanger. So it's pretty heavy, which is why my my rack looks kind of weird. This clothing rack I got at Target. Um, it's just a normal clothing rack. You can get it literally from Walmart or anything. Um, then I have all my shoes. You can go check out my shoe collection. I put some Converse there. And then this little grass pad is from Daiso. If you don't have a Daiso at your section, like where you live, I feel so sorry for you. Moving on to this little place that I literally love to death. This is literally where I'll find everything. We have my little Saturn here with all my necklaces. I don't really wear any. The only ones I wear is my middle name and this one. But that's cool to be there. You know, I can kind of see how my necklace looks now. Then I have this little thing I got from Shein to put my rings on. I told you guys, it's gonna come in handy. On the bottom, I placed like a mirror. I don't know why, but it just kind of looked more. And then here in this basket, I have extra rings and I just have it in the back. Then here is kind of my setup for my makeup. You can, I'll, I'll hold it, Penny. So, yep, here it's this. And then we have this. And then this is extra stuff. This is my hair extensions, just perfumes and deodorant this is all my hair stuff this is like lotion and makeup i don't know this is like q-tips and stuff like that and then here are all my pads and stuff and then the bottom is extra stuff so the little cabinet is from michael's i really suggest getting your organization at michael's literally they have so much shit i really suggest getting yours there now i'm moving on to my closet which is the last part of this video well of this room tour this i could literally make it into a walk-in closet and i could literally have all my clothes here and i wouldn't need that but since me and my mama loose and my puppy tony want to have their clothes in here um all of this like from here from here to here it's mine and from there to there is all of theirs and if you kind of get a glimpse inside oh that's all of their blankets that lady right there oh she left yeah, but here is this basket that um, my boyfriend gave me, and I have all my blankets in here. I got this at Lake Tahoe. This is my Glade and my Windex, which is mostly just what I need. In the back, I have a candle that reminds me of my boyfriend and I, so I... <sighs> it smells so good. It just brings me back to the old times. And then here, I have this thing that was in like my basket. So this is how my boyfriend asked me to be his girlfriend. So I keep it, I've kept it for almost a year. It says, will you be my girlfriend? And I kept it, yeah, I'm a hoarder. And then I have this little thing that also came in there. Oh, shit. And then, I just feel like that's gonna fall. Okay, okay, we'll organize that later. Here I have all my finals and my coats. It's not really organized. Here I have extra jeans in here. Um, and then on the bottom, I have more sweaters. I took the middle one out because it was broken. So I took it out and now I just kind of stack up on top of each other. 
And then these are my work shoes. I put them all in here. It's like weird ass extra shit. Um, but yeah, that concludes my room, guys. It was really quick. I pretty I think I talked really fast. Did I Danny? Yeah. Okay, but it's okay. Um, that's it guys for this room tour. I really hope you guys enjoyed. I'm super excited. Let me know if you guys want the link to anything. And yeah, that's my room tour, guys. Make sure to give the video a big thumbs up. Don't be subscribed. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.